it's not the lack of finances that's making us not progressive. It's the lack of leadership, you know, within the body, you know, not targeting Moses Sub because he is the president. But the issue is if you don't have the inherent nature as a leader, no matter what sort of intellect you have, leadership comes is a is something that that I'm a Muslim that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bestow on humans to be a leader and he's lacking certain capacities not that I have nothing against him but as you see boxing is an Olympic sport but it's at the lowest level in our country don't you feel that it's something that maybe the Federation needs to address internally and why hasn't it been addressed we as yet spoke to um, Patrick uh, Henry was the head of sports council, me and most itself. And my position was since the federation is fragmented, meaning we never make a quorum, I told them that it's, it's just sensible for us to dissolve and have a re election. Maybe someone who can be a better president than yourself. It shouldn't be our concerns if, if we're there or not, it's what we do. What's the impact you'd say that it's having on the athletes? Well, the impact it's having on the young people is that they become frustrated. They see they have the aspiration to be successful in the sport, but like they would say, coach, man, you know, uh, no, no, they happen. We have to make something happen for these young people. Sports is an industry. We encourage, honestly, in the country, we need to, we need to develop as far as understanding that. Tell us how, how are the internal conflicts translating and affecting you? Well, first of all, I agree with coach, where my coach, where he, he spoke right now. Um, I agree with my coach about everything because he gave me possibility to do his part, to do it better, training, to do good, book, good perform in Mexico. Because those people are training all the time, inspiring all the time, he help each other, but he represents his country. So right now, I'm here. We are Belize, right? started from the bottom. He tried to do it, develop something huge for this beautiful country, Belize, is so I think going to be great when we working everybody together like a friend, like a brother. So like this can be this country going to grow, expand all over the world. So I think right now I did my first step the way I doing my coach. So I did my first step, I started doing training in the morning, the afternoon, yeah putting my full intention to do it like represent Belize where my we're on it. All right. So now you have a match coming up. Tell us a little about that. Well, you know, somebody, my friend Frank Cancun, invited me to go over there because we did it first perform, um, like uh, December 19, so 2019. So we did it good, me and my friend. So right now, invite us to go to Cancun for five eight rounds. So it's going to be really good because it's a good event, big event. So right now we come with the news to let you know people from Belize, we start develop professional boxing. All right, so when is this match taking place? It's going to be in this, in the end of this month, and 28, 28, 28, in Cancun, like a Grand Oasis. Yeah, so we expect to, go, to give you a good performance. So I feel confident enough to do it, I feel excited. Trained enough? Oh yeah, a lot. So my coach had, like he said, he teach me a lot of discipline, my emotional and physical. So I feel really, really good for that. Do you know who your opponent will be? Uh, right now, no.